Well, it's finally happened, folks. Amazon has now launched what I am coining Mark of the Beast tech. It's live and in your face. I, I can't even believe we are finally at this point. It's 2023, it's the end of 2023. And I will officially tell you today, I, I, I'm getting goosebumps as I even say this to you, but I can officially tell you today that if there was an antichrist that was alive right now, we could have the mark of the beast. There could actually be something called the mark of the beast because the tech, the technology, the availability, the option, the 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 avenue, the railroad, the the street that we could walk down is actually available for us to have the mark of the beast. Let me take you to the story. You can see that Amazon One has released. This just happened like a week ago, December, November twenty seventh. Look at that. Uh, app, uh, Amazon One has introduced Amazon One Enterprise. It's a new palm-based identity service for organizations and, and improves the security of physical spaces and digital assets, reduces operational costs, and adds convenience for users while protecting personal data. Uh, Boone Edom, the IHG Hotels and Resorts, uh, Pasnick and Cohn, among others, uh, partners using Amazon One Enterprise. Uh, I'm not going to read the whole article, but you can see that picture there. Uh, of that lady scanning her hand. So you guys are all aware of the option that you can pay with your palm when you go to Whole Foods now. Amazon Fresh, and, you know, any of these Amazon stores, of course, Whole Foods is owned by Amazon. So you can pay with your palm. In fact, uh, the one in Los Angeles, there's one in the Valley uh, north of Ventura Boulevard that I've gone into and they actually have a lady standing there and she says, are you going to pay with your palm? And I say, no. And she says, okay, then go, you have to go this way and you have to go to a different entrance. They allow, if you pay digitally with your palm, you're allowed to enter in through the main entrance. So they're already programming us to uh, look at people that are willing to do palm uh, pay as privileged, as better than everyone else. And you got to take the back entrance or the side entrance. You're not allowed, not allowed to go where everybody goes. And now Amazon One is introducing the same idea, a palm print, a palm access point, instead of what? The key fobs or those little key cards. When you, you know, I, I used to work at a restaurant years ago and they had this little key card and we had to touch the key card when we clock in, uh, you know, and, and work uh, for the restaurant that night. And so uh, those are all those acting days when I was an actor and trying to have a job at night and work during, you know, not work during the day, work during night. But uh, they say, oh, people have lost the key cards. We can't find them. They're nowhere to be found. So we have to replace them all the time and the money and da 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 da, da. Well, that may be their excuse. It may be easier for us to screen our palm and enter into a build building. And now we have IHG Hotels, which is a very huge, you probably know IHG Hotels. They're a huge chain. Uh, guys, I can't even believe I'm telling you this. But Amazon has made Mark of the Beast tech. You watch, you watch. There is going to be churches that use this technology and say you can't enter into the church until we scan your palm because we want to identify who you are and take your attendance. We want to take the attendance of the church. It's going to happen. There's going to be churches that are going to take the Mark of the Beast and are going to use palm prints as a mean means of access, and a, like an access point. And the Bible says in uh, Revelation chapter 13, verse 15, but we'll start at 16 through 18. Let's read it. It says right here that, and he causeth all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads, and that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name. Here is wisdom, let him understand, it hath understanding. Count the number of the beast, for it is a number of man, and his number is 603 score and six. So we're talking about the mark of the beast here is what we're talking about. We're talking about there's going to be a, a scan, a palm print, a chip. There's going to be an eye scan. There's going to, and without that scanning apparatus, mechanism, or opportunity, you will not be able to buy or sell. Well, Amazon does it now. If you scan your palm print, you're able to go to this line. And now they've introduced Amazon One, which is this enterprise for businesses 
to have employees scan their palm print and you can access the building, the secured building, if you will, on a palm print. And you wait. Churches are going to start doing this. They're going to start taking attendance and they're going to say, it's not the mark of the beast. We're just helping. We're just figuring out who's who. They're going to excuse it away. I'm telling you guys, the prophecies of the Bible are coming to pass. I'm telling you right now, before it happens, that there is going to be the mark of the beast. There is going to be a financial ultimatum. It's going to be a chip. It's going to be a a palm print. It's going to be an eye scan. It's going to be that apparatus. And that will be the mark of the beast. If there was an antichrist right now alive on the earth saying he was the Messiah and so forth, and we had to pledge allegiance to him, we could have the mark of the beast in 2024. Absolutely. It's available. It's, it's a, it's a possibility to have the tech. Now, let me just stop for a second. There has to be an antichrist for there to be a mark of the beast. And we don't have an antichrist right now. We don't even have a third temple built yet. There has to be a third temple built before you can have an antichrist. So we got some events ahead of us. Uh, before we can have certain things happen, uh, Matthew 24, Jesus talks about this. We know in 2 Thessalonians chapter 2, verse 1 through 4, that there is uh, coming a time where we are going to see an Antichrist that exalts himself above all that is called God so that he is worshipped as God. We're going to see that. But right now, Amazon One is in fact invented and applying and you can your business you may walk into your job uh, next year and your business is doing amazon one and they're going to make you palm print should you do it i wouldn't do it at all i'd say i'm not working here if i'm if i'm i put my foot down i'm saying i'm not doing this i'm not doing this i'm not doing that i have to draw a line in the sand because if you don't you may get too close and you may it may become blurry so This is exciting times. Prophecy is coming alive. They that understand amongst the people shall instruct many. Power is knowledge and the lack of it is death.